Others in Palm Beach County can feel a little safer while out on the water. The county is now working directly with the U.S. Coast Guard to share life saving information from 911 calls for search and rescue missions. Megan McRoberts is live in Boca Raton to explain how this new partnership will benefit boaters in danger. Megan? Well, Kelly, if boaters like the ones behind me get into any trouble out on the sea, they know they have a radio on board that they can use to get directly in touch with the Coast Guard. But what if that radio battery dies or they're on a boat without a radio? Now boaters can get in touch with the Coast Guard directly with their cell phones thanks to a new county and Coast Guard agreement. Nick Cardella returns from a day out on the water. We left the dock here at like, I don't know, 8.30. He spends most of his days on the water as a commercial fisherman. He knows at times the ocean can be dangerous. And one time we had our bilge pump get stuck and our battery died. So at that point, there was no way even the call Coast Guard. Nick says his line of communication is typically limited to his radio if there's a problem. Go on channel 16 and call Coast Guard. But with a dead battery, he could be helpless. Palm Beach County now working with the Coast Guard to give boaters a backup plan. They're testing how far the range is for cell phones out in the ocean, and they found that it's upwards of 10 miles out. County Commissioner Steve Abrams says the county signed an agreement with the Coast Guard to work together during ocean emergencies. Dispatchers can now relay cell phone 911 calls directly to the Coast Guard and give the Coast Guard a caller's exact GPS location. This really will save people's lives out on the seas. Something that would have come in very handy in the recent case of a former NFL player who had to swim miles to shore. Case of Rob Conrad the, uh, from the Dolphins. If he had had a cell phone in his pocket, of course, in a waterproof case, he would have been able to call 911. It's a second lifeline, and for Cardella, peace of mind should he run into any other problems at sea. And this new agreement will also allow the Coast Guard to continue testing cell phone reception even farther out into the ocean in the future. The Coast Guard still urging boaters, if you do come into an emergency situation, still use your radio first before using your cell phone to call 911. In Boca Raton tonight, Megan McRoberts, WPTV News Channel 5.